Hello friends, welcome to the Dog Mall. In this video, we'll compare some characteristics of Presta Canario vs. Rottweiler. Which is best for you? Let's jump on it. Muscularity. The Presta Canario is a massive dog with a heavy muscular body. This dog is large, powerful, intelligent, and headstrong. The force of a bite can be relevant to an exclusive dog, including its mood and motivation for biting, not just its heredity. It's also universally considered to be in the top 10 of the most powerful canine biters. On the other hand, the Rottweiler is typically a solid and muscular breed that's pretty adept at using its strength and energy to preserve your family and boss over them. Although several people feel that the breed resembles scary, Rottweilers are powerful and can be an incredible sight. Energy Level Presa Canarios are large, muscular, and powerful dogs that can seem highly intimidating. These dogs have a well-deserved status as being strong-willed and difficult to control. Their presence improves this reputation. They are large, muscular, and powerful dogs that can look notably intimidating. On the other hand, the Rottweiler's energy level changes from couch potato to the whirlwind. Be sure to tell the breeder what kind of energy level suits you so she can support you in determining the best puppy for your lifestyle. Moderately active Rottweilers will enjoy a couple of 10 to 20 minute walks each day. Temperament The Presta Canario temperament can be a concern. Different dog breeds have different traits, but most dogs are not born aggressive. Critical behavior usually appears as a result of wide-ranging environmental factors. On the other hand, the ideal Rottweiler is patient, confident, and courageous, never shy. He has a self-assured aloofness and doesn't obtain companions with people instantly or indiscriminately. Instead, he takes a wait-and-see attitude with new people or situations. With his family, he's affectionate, often following them around the house. Easy to train. As a rule, the Presta Canario is not an easy dog to train and can be a challenging dog. Notably, for those who have little experience with this breed, Presta Canarios can be stubborn, dominant, and require calm and positive leadership. On the other hand, Rottweilers are stubborn and impossible to train. This is a breed that has accomplished that much can be trained. Rottweilers do have willful personalities, but they are also intelligent and enjoy learning. They make highly devoted family dogs when they're trained correctly and with consistency. Health Conditions Perro de Presa Canarios are healthy dogs. Health problems that have been observed in the Presa include orthopedic diseases such as hip and elbow dysplasia, osteochronditis, disecans, and pantyostasis, eye problems such as entropion, hypothyroidism, demodectic mange, epilepsy, and cryptocortisitum. On the other hand, Rottweilers are breeds that are most afflicted by hip dysplasia, a genetic deformity where the head of the femur doesn't fit accurately into the hip socket. This situation is excruciating and frequently needs hip replacement surgery, costing thousands of dollars to correct. Even with the surgery, the dog is likely to develop arthritis as he ages. Grooming Needs Being a smooth-coated breed, the Presta Canario needs minimum upkeep and among grooming. Instead, the weekly at-home grooming regimen includes shedding control. While Presta lacks the dense undercoat observed in several breeds, they still shed and benefit from a good brush out at least once a week. On the other hand, Rottweilers are intelligent and faithful family members. These robust puppies have a coarse, dense coat with an undercoat influenced by the climate. They are a smooth-coated breed and need little more than frequent brushing and an occasional bath to sustain a healthy, shiny coat. Good with children. Presta Canario is one of the most excellent family dogs. They love children and can live beside them utterly. Presta Canario is one of the most talented breeds and easy to train. They are so patient and have so much brain, but they require strong hands, so they're not for everyone. On the other hand, Rottweilers typically like children, significantly if they're established with them. Children, particularly young ones, should be controlled because they are so big and strong. When different dogs and cats support Rottweilers, they generally get along well with them. So, who is the winner? Let us know by commenting below.